doing now? Yeah, well, we all have to do things we don't like doing, but we do them, don't we? So give it here. Because I don't talk much, people think I don't have anything to say. I might be able to help you. You're not clever enough. And that's not true. I have lots of things to say. I'm just afraid to say them. How'd you do? How'd do you what? X plus Y is a story about a young boy who is on the autistic spectrum and it's the story of him on a journey to compete at the International Mathematical Olympiad. You have successfully earned a place on the United Kingdom Math Squad. Oh my goodness! Nathan is a really interesting kid. I should study. He suffers from Asperger's and he has a, a particular fascination with patterns and colours and he's also a mathematical genius. Nathan! Riding in the back won't help me. Would you like to come up and show us? The character of Nathan is a fascinating character. And he just sees the world in a unique way and it's, it's lovely. Nathan! Nathan! This is the guy that we fight over. And every day, That's all, it's all I do is stare at him. And all she does is stare That's at him. That's all I do, I and, stare at him. Um, like this, you ready? Practice something. Okay, one, all two, right. three. He's an incredible mathematical genius but also it's about his quest for the formula for love in a way. So it's a very emotional story. What are you doing? Come up. He doesn't connect with the emotional uh, side of his character. Uh, not that he doesn't have one, but he just doesn't connect with it. He's locked that away. He's just very different to anyone she's ever met. And Nathan really helps John May to find her inner peace. Three, two, one. And not to live for others, which is actually expected in the Chinese culture. You are the cleverest young brains in this country. We will be training with four other national teams in Taiwan. He's not in any sort of social group. He has no way of expressing any sort of interaction with people. Even his mum, he has a really hard time interacting with her. With Nathan, it's it's been difficult, and that communication, it's always been quite awkward, and she's never felt that bond. Knowing that your child loves you is just fundamental. He had a very traumatic experience when he was a boy, and he prefers to deal with the rational world that does the mathematical world, he understands that world, it makes sense. A one followed by a one turned into a zero. And that means you can't keep taking away from a positive integer without it turning negative. Good work. Through the course of the film, those emotions are unlocked. And at the end, Issa produced an incredible performance. But it's also a story of celebrating human achievement and, and this kind of great mass genius. You sort of look at it on a wider scale about people and society, acceptance. I think those are the really core themes of the film. Another round of my brain works differently. When somebody loves you, it means that they see something in you that they think is worth something, adds value to you. I'll try and slip you somebody else, it's all right. It's cheating. You know, I was joking. <laughs>